guys and welcome to my youtube channel this is the first video i'm posting on my channel and it's going to be a little q a so you can get to know me a bit better and my fishing on my channel i'm going to be posting regular videos of when i'm fishing either carp fishing pike fishing perch fishing any different types of fishing that i'll be doing i'll film as much as i can and try and get the content as good as i can for you guys watching at home so as i said today i'm going to do a q a i asked many of you to ask me questions on my instagram and my facebook if you haven't already, go follow my Instagram, I'll leave my username just down the bottom here. And yeah, let's get into the Q&A. What is my new setup? So recently I just bought the new Nash Dwarf ES rods in 10 foot 3.5 pound test curve and Nash BP10 reels. Along with that I've got the Siren R3s and yeah, that's my setup at the moment. How did I get into fishing? So basically one day, Charlie, who's here with me now, he's doing a little bit of float fishing on the lake, asked me to come fishing with him. I thought, oh, why not? Went down to the lake with him. He blanked, as per usual. <laughs> I'm joking. He blanked, but I loved it. <laughs> I loved it, so from then, I just went and bought a fishing set up and just started fishing from then. And yeah, I've just fished from then, really. Eddie said, why does Lauren sell her tackle only to buy more in a few weeks and months, despite being advised not to do it. Ed, it's the only time you're gonna be right, mate. Why was I selling my gear? So I was selling my gear to start up traveling and I don't know, stupid idea really. If you could go to any country to go fishing, where would it be? If I had to choose one country in the whole world to go fishing, it would be Thailand. And I'm gonna put up some pictures now of why I would go to Thailand. It looks absolutely amazing there and I'm thinking about doing it next year. What is my favourite fish? My favourite fish is a 24 pound 2 ounce common, which isn't my PB, but I caught it from my park lake at early hours in the morning and it is, in my opinion, the best fish that I have caught yet. Do you like to fish over a spod mix or do I prefer free bait? Totally depends. If I'm fishing at a distance, it'll be spodding, but normally I do prefer fishing over free baits. But as I said, it totally depends on the lake I am at. Distance fishing or close in stalking. When I am at a lake, I do prefer to fish close in when I'm stalking. So when I see the carp right in front of me, it makes me a lot more excited to catch it. What's your favorite bait? My favorite bait is Nash Citrus, mainly the pop-ups. That is what I use to fish with most of the time that I fish and it catches 95% of the fish that I do catch. Day tickets or clubs slash syndicates. Me personally, I prefer day tickets as I do prefer to fish on park lakes and I've never actually fished on the syndicate. So yeah, that's why I'd choose day tickets. If you had to choose out of Nash Citrus or Instant Action, what would it be? Me, as I said before, it'll be Citrus, but the Instant Action is really good. If you're on a budget, go for Instant Action, but for me, definitely the Citrus. What do you hope to achieve in the future and any tips for carp fishing on the river? In the future, I'd like to catch a PB above 30 pounds and as for the carp fishing on the river i have not yet done it but i will soon be hitting the rivers so watch out for my videos on them are you a member of any syndicate lakes as i said before i have never joined a syndicate but it could be something that i look into for the future what's my uk pb my uk pb is 27 pound two ounce caught at my park lake and i caught it on a two night session with my mates will said am i your favorite fishing youtuber Will, hard question mate, I like a lot of fishing YouTubers, but I'll have to get back to you on that one. <laughs> Would you plan to team up with any other YouTube bloggers or vloggers for a collaboration video? I've only just started YouTube as you can tell, but it could be something that I do. If you do want to do a collaboration video, comment down below or DM me on my Instagram and I could look into it and I'll let you know. Why do you think fishing appeals more to dudes than chicks? So a lot more men prefer fishing as it is normally classed as a men's sport but 
women don't really like it as much because they don't really like being out in the cold. They don't really like being out overnight. And yeah, they just, I don't know, don't want to get dirty, I suppose. But as I say that, try and encourage more women to get out on the bank, even if it's your girlfriend, friends, try and get more girls out on the bank. What is a good bait company that has reasonable prices? So with Nash, they have an instant action range, which is very cheap, get on that. But there are hundreds of other companies out there that do all different types of bait, different prices. You have to look into it for yourself and see what actually will work at your venue that you are fishing. What is your dream destination? My dream destination is Gillam's in Thailand. Absolutely amazing. And if I do go there next year, I'll be sure to film the whole trip of when I'm fishing there. What is your favourite luggage? At the moment, Nash is bringing out a new range. They've got the Recon Rucksack that comes out at the end of January. Looks absolutely pucker. Definitely getting it as soon as it comes out. And yeah, that looks that absolute nuts. What is your go-to bait and rig? Already answered my bait, but my go-to rig would definitely be the Slip D rig. If I'm not using the Slip D, I'd use the IQD rig, but they are my top two favourite rigs. Greg Ellis said, do you know that media whore? So guys, if you don't know already, Greg absolutely loves social media. Can't get enough of it. Always posting, always wanting the likes, always like promoting his YouTube videos. No, but for real, <laughs> If you haven't seen Greg's videos already, I'll leave the link in my description below. Go watch his videos. What are your plans for 2019 or 2020? So that's a really wide question, but I'd like to visit other countries to fish. And also I'd like to catch a perch and a barbel. They're my top two and also a PB. Callum said, if you could choose the best angler to fish with, who would it be? Not including your boyfriend. I don't know who Callum's on about, my boyfriend, I don't have a boyfriend, just to let you all know. No, I'm joking. <laughs> uh, if I had to choose one angler to fish with, it would be Alan Blair, 100%. Absolutely amazing angler, and I'd love to fish with him. Would you ever come to Croatia? Never really thought about it, but it could be something I look into. But at the moment, not really. But I'll have to see what happens. What's your favourite method of fishing? For me, surface fishing is my favourite. I love it when it's, you can see all the carp on the surface and it's all intense when you try and catch one. When you put your hook bait right in front of their mouth and then the line just tightens. It's just the best way of fishing in my opinion. If not, it'll be zig fishing and as Callum says, get on the black foam. <laughs> Charlie laughing in the background. The parrot or heather the leather? In my opinion, I would have liked to catch the parrot, but the heavily leather is a really nice carp as well but yeah the parrot for me how much do you bait so i reckon that means how much bait do i use in the average session and what do i use foilies or particle for me i bait little and often unless i need to bait a lot which is not very regular so little and often and i use foilies maggots sweet corn and so on another question from greg ellis he said have you watched the Ellis Diary? Sorry Greg mate, I don't watch Blankers, so nah, nah I'm joking. Yeah, I've watched most of them, so if you haven't already, like I said earlier, go and watch his videos. Right guys, I hope you liked watching my Q&A. If you have any other questions that I didn't answer, comment them down below and I'll reply to you. Follow my Instagram, like my Facebook page, turn the notifications on so you can keep updated for any more of my videos, and make sure to hit that subscribe button right now. I'll be filming very soon, me fishing on the local park lake, hopefully bag a few to show you. Make sure you watch that. I'll see you in the next video. Hope you enjoyed. See you later.